Vincent, news this morning that Austria's OMV has bought about a three billion dollars worth of assets in the North Sea from Statoil of Norway. Why is it doing that? Well, uh, it wants to be a much bigger presence in the North Sea for a start. Um, OMV is a curious kind of oil company. It's obviously based in Vienna and it has a big production in Romania and its traditional base is sort of Central Europe. It has North African interests as well and a bit in the Middle East. And it, it sort of wants to get away from unstable regions like North Africa and into more stable re regions like the North Sea. So from OMV's point of view, this is a transaction that's actually worth it. It's buying f a slice of four wells um, for r about $3 billion. That probably will be the ultimate cost of the transaction. And what's the size and shape of what they're buying? W only one of the fields is really in production at the moment. The, tw uh, the other three are coming on stream very soon. Um, but they're going to require a lot of capex to get them up to that uh, production level. So OMV is, you know, as well as buying the stake in the fields, it's also obviously making commitments to capex over the long, long term. Um, so it's financially a major transaction for OMV. In fact, it's the biggest acquisition the company has ever made. So, but I think it, it you know, it certainly from, from OMV's strategic point of view, there's a lot of logic to this deal. And all oil companies want um, high quality assets in stable regions. Presumably this has come at a price. Oh, absolutely it does, yes. It's paying just over $3.1 billion in total for the four assets it's buying. It's also getting a handful of licenses in, into the bargain. Um, Actually, OMV is quite cash generative, so it can pay for this from internal resources and um, it's free cash flow, which is pretty decent, actually. Um, so it, its ability to do this transaction is not really in dispute, but these are very expensive um, deals. I mean, it's about eight and a half dollars a barrel, I guess, equivalent um, price, which is which is full for even for nor you know, North Sea assets that are very high tech and easy to produce and, and um, you know it's 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 high quality oil it's still pricey and normally when a company makes a big acquisition like this for high quality assets uh, share price can um, come under pressure what, what did the market think of the deal today well the market I think probably will be in the long term I think you know fairly sanguine about this transaction the shares fell two percent today but OMV has been a very strong performer this year it's actually I think the top European oil company performer on the stock market so far this year it probably can you know, it, it, I guess what will happen from now on is the share price will be under a bit of pressure because of the transaction. But, you know, it's, it's done very well up to now. OK, well, who says everything happens in the Mediterranean over summer? It also happens in the North Sea. Thank you very much for that update, Vincent.